They've got helicopters. We should expect them to come from the air. Hmm. The Soviets did as well. So we stay beneath the trees. They can't hit what they can't see. They'll cut us down, no matter where we fight. We know this land better than they ever will. Don't forget that. We only had one more day to prepare. But we can drive them out, can't we? You were there when we drove the Soviets out. People need to hear we can do it again. I didn't think we could do it then. And it took ten years. Better to say nothing. Prehistoric carving of the bear. The stone looks like it could have come from this valley. I need more wood for the fire. We'll have to make do with what we have. Well, if they need arrowheads for the battle, then I need more firewood. I've already cut plenty. Besides, I don't know how much more time you'll have left to forge. Hmm. We can make points faster than broadheads. That should be our focus. Another difficult winter for my people. There are more deaths than births now. And as the seasons pass, the young ones are becoming restless. I see them looking to the sky when the rare plane passes overhead. Wistful. Wondering. Longing. I know they are still deeply committed to the cause. But I also sense a change coming. An end to our way of life is on the horizon. The most recent invaders are fading from memory. But as the technology of men advances, more are bound to find our valley again. And we are bound with the fate of this place. For better, or worse. Greetings. You're Jacob's guest. If you're looking for a way to help, they're repairing the guard towers just down the path. I mean no offense, but you don't look like you're ready for a turn on the anvil. Not much fuel left in the tour. I promised to keep them safe. What have I done? We should have been ready for this. prison a few summers back. After that, you're back to using a hammer and chisel. There's got to be more. The Soviets left everything behind. We spent two full days combing the old buildings. That's the last of the fuel. Don't worry. Can you see anything from up there? No, I'm trying to get the structure repaired. You want the whole thing to fall when the wind picks up? Just keep your eyes out. I'll be here at any moment. I'll do what I can. How's the cutting coming?
You there. We could use some help if that's what you're here for. I'm here to help. What can I do? We're trying to fortify as many of these towers as we can. Most of them were badly damaged in last year's floods. We've got the repairs in hand, but I need some extra supplies from around the valley. If we can get these towers repaired, it'll give us an advantage over the invaders, and it'll help us reach the upper levels of the ruined towers. Will you help? I'll see what I can round up. Thank you. Bring them back to me when you found them. Do you have the supplies we need? Here you are. This should be everything you asked for. Good, good. Leave some of the supplies in the basket there, and we'll finish the repairs. But I need you to bring the rest of the supplies down to the tower by the lakeshore. When you're done, meet me back here. Sophia was less than welcoming. I understand. I'm just glad you were there to vouch for me. My people have spent decades fighting outsiders. It's not an easy habit to break. See if you can lend a hand with the preparations. A little hard work would go a long way towards building trust. I'll see what I can do. likely come from the air. Jacob is assembling fighters in the upper village to draw their attention there. The children and those too old to fight will be safely hidden in the Acropolis catacombs. I will go there once things are in hand here. You said they were heavily armed. How can we expect to meet
There's got to be something down there. This architecture predates the rise of Eastern Orthodoxy. What were they doing here? A gold belt buckle. Decorative, but strong and functional. Hmm, it appears to be part of a military uniform. <laughs> 